Question 59. Let t of n be defined by the function uh, where t of, t of 0 is 4, t of 1 is 4, and then t of n equals uh, t of n divided by 2, the minimum of that, and, and t, uh, the floor of that, and then the floor of t uh, of 4, t of n over 4 plus c of n for all integers n greater than 2. Now, <coughs> um, here I should write this equation out here just so you can see it. This is t of n equals t of the floor of n over 2 plus t of the floor of n over 4 plus c of n. That's the proper equation, but let's just take a look at Now, there's probably a recurrence relation that you can write out and do a lot of fancy math on this thing. In a real test, I'm not sure that it's really worth the time to do that, if, especially if you just look at the problem in a little, you know, and look at the options that we have. We have option A is theta log n, option B is theta n, option C is n log n, d n squared and e is n to the log base 3 of 4, I don't know, anyway. If you do the math out and you just say, well, given n, what is t of n? And I just discounted this, this constant c of n. Um, what you end up getting is, uh, you know, n is 0 is 4, as a given in the equation, 1 is 4, 2 would be n divided by 2, which is 2, which, which would be 1, right? So it's t of 1 plus t of 0 plus c of n, that's going to end up being 8, 8, 12, and so forth. So you basically write down n and then write down t of n and look at the results. What you'll find is that it's definitely not n anything exponential. If anything, it's going it's less than, than n. Um, and so it's not n log n. Now, you can, it's, it's not n log n, it's not n squared, it's not n to the log 3 of uh, 4. I don't know what the hell that, that thing is. But, so the choices is, the only real choices are it's, it's log n, which is a, or it's theta of n, which is b. Now you can see that it's definitely not log n. It's not splitting in half each time. So the only left real option left is b theta of n. And I did that just by just by computing out all these numbers and seeing what's n and what's th uh, t of n. It isn't fancy, and, and I'm sure there's a more rigorous mathematical way of doing this, but in the test it gets you to the right answer. So. Hopefully that's helpful.